there is the face on stone for Merlin. Right, down here is Merlin's cave and that's where we go now. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe and turn the notification bell on so you will always get a notification when I upload a new video. Well, they told us that here that was once one big rock so you were able to cross without a bridge and then it collapsed and now this stuff is all laying down here here we are this is merlin's cave let's go in there look how massive it is it's massive, it's going so far in there. I know it's quite dark here, but this is the way in. And on the other side, you can go out. So it's actually a tunnel. With the tide going in and out, obviously the cave is filling with water as well and at the moment the tide is out so we can actually walk here and it's pretty cool. So over here is the cave and here is such a beautiful waterfall. Look at this! Right, apparently here somewhere around at the cave there is the face on stone from Merlin and it's it's somewhere around I can't find it right now but I will I will still look for it because I want to know where that is somewhere on the stone when you visit Merlin's cave you need to look out for the sculpture look at his face it's so cool it's so detailed and i can tell you the exact position so basically there are the bridges where we came down and on this side here is the entrance of the cave We left the castle now so we can go on a walk at the cliffs. If you go for a walk at the cliffs, it's absolutely amazing that you have this amazing view to the castle. It's cool. Really, if you go here, go for a walk on the cliffs.
We found some cows. Look at them all. And we're back up in this little village. And it's super cute, super little. And sadly, everything is already shot because it's apparently already late. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video.